हेलो फ्रेंड्स आई डॉक्टर श्वेता मिश्रा असिस्टेंट प्रोफेसर डिपार्टमेंट ऑफ कॉमर्स एंड मैनेजमेंट बियानी ग्रुप ऑफ कॉलेजेस वेलकम्स यू ऑल ऑन बिहाफ ऑफ गुरु के पी ओ डॉट कॉम द टॉपिक विच आई गोइंग टू डिस्कस टूडे इज हाउ टू सॉल्व एन असाइनमेंट प्रॉब्लम विद इज इम्पॉसिबल असाइनमेंट दैट इज प्रोहिबिटेड रूट्स हे इज द प्रॉब्लम गिवन टू अस दीज आर द कॉस्ट रुपीज सेवन थाउजेंड इज द कॉस्ट फ्रॉम कंपनी सी वन टू बिट ए 8000 is the cost from company C1 to bid B and so as follows these are the cost these are the places or the cells where no assignment is given to us so we'll take here the highest possible assignment that is M M and M these are the highest possible cost which we are assuming as such we are not giving any of the assignment to this cell now following the procedure of assignment we are going to start with the step 1 that is row minimization we have to subtract the least entry of each row from the respective elements of each row now 7000 is the least L L entry in the first row so here it comes to 0 it's 1000 when we are going to we have not to touch m in any of the cases so here it's m it's m now c2 it's m least entry 7000 to h comes 0 0 c3 it's 5000 so here it's 1000 m 0 m and here next is 7000 so it's m m 0 and 1000 this is our row treatment now next we are going to move towards the second step that is our column treatment here the least entries each column is 0 so we'll write down the same numbers as it is in next it's again 0 in c column again it comes to 0 so we'll round, write down the same entries again and in d again it's 0 so we'll write down the same entries now we'll cut the lines as per our requirement so the maximum zeros are here two zeros here two zeros and here one zero now the next step is to select the least entry from the entries which are not covered by the lines and the least entry is 1000 so we'll again start with the treatment we have to subtract this least entry from the cells which are not covered by the lines and have to add this point at the points where they are intersecting Zero, zero. It's M, it's M, M, zero and zero. Now we'll again start with lines. Here it's two zero, one zero. Here in column two zero and two zero. So we'll cut the maximum zeros in this way. Now the zero is remaining four. Now we'll get the number of lines equal to the number of rows and columns. So now our solution is complete. Now we'll move to the next step in finding out the solution. Now C one, C two, C three, and C four. For C one, the zero. Now we'll start with the allocations. Here there is a single zero. So we'll insert with a block. In this particular column, there is a single zero. And third is this, and fourth is. this now these are our allocations we'll start writing c1 is for a c2 is for b 
C3 is for C and C4 it is for D. Now, we will put the values for A its value is 7000, for B its value is 7000, for C its value is 5000 and for D its value is 8000. Now, it comes to 27000 rupees. Now, this is our answer. Thank you. For more information video, please like, comment, share and do not forget to subscribe our YouTube channel. Thank you.